what's going on guys so we've already talked about this once but criminal mods man uh did announce their uh shutdown by take two which is rockstar um and they made another post uh pretty much saying that no more gta 5 services things like that and uh that they would be uh reevaluating their site and uh putting on different uh games i'm not going to name any specific games but uh you guys can go check that out man um through their source that they posted uh, but man, uh, Criminal Mods was the biggest, uh, or most popular, whatever you want to call it. They were the biggest, uh, site or source, uh, for the GTA community and, or the most trusted, I'd say. And I mean, the most used, I would assume. I mean, there's a lot of other ones that were too, but, uh, Criminal Mods was definitely one of the most known for sure. And, uh, probably the most popular. Uh, but I mean, there were a lot of other good sources too. I'm not going to name any specific, but, uh, but yeah, man, I mean, Criminal Mods, uh is gone as far as gta 5 is concerned now this is uh it's not really good either for gta 6 because now that source is completely gone you know and it's one of the most popular ones and and the most legit ones probably well i mean oh, there's a lot of them that are legit but yeah i think you know what i'm trying to say <laughs> uh, let's see what we're gonna call in um so now it makes me wonder what site's going to be next? You know what I mean? Are a lot of these sites going to start getting, uh, you know, notifications from Take Two? I mean, what's actually going to happen? Is he coming after me? Um, what's actually going to happen with that? You know what I mean? Uh, I've actually asked a couple of sites already specifically about that. And they have said that they haven't gotten anything yet, but it's always possible. You know what I mean? Anything or any site that goes against their EULA agreements or the TOS uh, policy things like that i mean there's always a risk that something can happen even for your own account that you have right uh it doesn't matter if it's a dupe account or non-dupe or a more og or whatever um it could still get hit now rockstar i think has initiated another band wave um and not really so much for the dupes this time come on cops had to take him out but uh, for like Deluxos, like cash and Deluxo accounts, things like that. And I remember that you're only supposed to do like six a day or something like that. Uh, what's this kid doing? But I think, damn, <laughs> Leatherface 0818 at us. Um, I don't know. I'm not. I'm not for sure on that. I've, I've never had. A, I've had an account that's had a lot of Deluxos, but I've never had to sell a bunch to be able to get money on my stuff so i'm not 100 percent sure on that um but i would believe it you know what i mean i've had about 10 people now uh tell me that they've gotten their account either suspended or banned so i think this one's not as uh as crucial as the last one was i mean the last one you were probably talking about at least fifty thousand plus accounts you know what i mean what in the f yo what is bro wearing yo what that is insane bro look like he just got out of a uh I don't know. <laughs> Out of the hood, I guess. Uh, bro was chilling with the ballas. Um, but nah, man. I, I, I'm just like curious to see like what's going to happen next with all this stuff. Man, I had a feeling that this would happen at some point. Anyways, Palm Tree saved him, man. It was determined. Damn. Bro got airtime on that. Damn. Um, but you know, Rockstar has waited a long time to do this i mean i think it has to do gta plus i think uh i think they really want it to be successful obviously if you don't believe that then i don't know it seems like a lot of people have been driving this here lately he's not driving it no more <laughs> five six demon um but you know in gta 6 man i mean we may see very limited uh mod of the counts at any point and at least for a long time because what is bro doing imagine being afk in gta online in 2024 just imagine come on man just turn off your console man just turn off your console then go eat with your granny come on man the spaghetti will still be on the plate i promise <laughs> but uh but nah man um there's no telling what's gonna happen in the future i really hope uh for good success with gta 6 and but you know there's still so many broken things in gta 5 we got this crazy invisible god mode glitch going on right now man i mean we got the sticky bomb and the rc bandito thing the agency glitch i think is still going on 
I mean, there's so many problems that Rockstar could be focusing on, but they're worried about these modded account sites and they're worried about modded accounts and banning them and stuff like that. You guys have waited too long. I'm sorry. You guys, you guys have done waited way too damn long uh, to be doing this. You know what I mean? Uh, they could have been doing this years ago. And, uh, you know, they do whatever they want. It's their game, but it's like, you guys could have been doing this so long ago, man. Like, why now? That's why it makes me think it's GTA Plus, and they're wanting people to get that and get shark cards. You know what I mean? Who is going to pay $100 for a shark card and only get $8 million? Not me. And, and a lot of other people won't either. Damn. A lot of other people won't do it either. You know what I mean? Uh, I'm not doing it. But in GTA 6, there's going to be a lot of people that... Um, I don't know. They're gonna. We're all going to be broke. We're all going to be back to square one. We're all going to be trying to figure out the best ways to get uh, money, things like that. I mean, it's going to be... It's probably going to be more expensive than GTA 5. Let's just be honest. Um, but who knows? You know what I mean? They could lower the stuff. I mean, Rockstar knows it's expensive. I mean, compare it back to... Uh, Compare it back to old gen days, man. I mean, things are not like they used to be. That's why I always say it's like we got a different game nowadays. You know what I mean? So, we're just going to have to wait and see what happens, honestly. Let's see. Do I have an oppressor mark one? We're going to have to wait and see what happens. You know, I uh, like I said, I wish the best for uh, for GTA 6. I know I'm, I'm hyped about it, but I'm not going to get, like, too crazy about it just for the fact of, uh, uh, the fact of it being... We still haven't got the second trailer yet. We don't know if it's going to be delayed. I'm not going to get myself hyped up over it. Um, we're just flying away. Um, and yeah, I mean, it's just not its just not worth doing that to me. I mean, when GTA 5 got delayed, everybody was fucking... Everybody was bummed out about it and stuff like that. I was bummed out about it because they announced it. I mean, it had almost a year delay. Damn, BST strong. Had almost a year delay. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So... I don't know. We're just gonna have to wait and see. Uh, but yeah, now, like I said, going back to these uh, to this mod of the count stuff, man. I really wonder if if most most of these sites are gonna be taken down, or if they're just gonna like completely forget about it and just move on. You know what I mean? Um, but there's not really. I mean, okay, you can you can sit here and shut down all the sources or whatever. People still got their accounts. You know what I mean? The, the businesses would be doing bad, but I mean, come on, man. GTA 5 is nearing the end. We got GTA 6 coming on the way, even though it's still not here. But GTA 5 is nearing the end. It's like, you guys could have done this so long ago. Why did you wait this long to do it? Because now you done waited too long. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know, man. But hey, let me know what you guys think about this in the comments, man. It's really unfortunate, man. Big shout out to Criminal Mods, man, for being a legit source for all those years that they did it. Um, I can't even remember how many years. Probably at least four years, three, four years, somewhere in there. Maybe longer. But like I said, they are going to be continuing with other games, man. So make sure you guys uh, continue to support them, man, if you guys um, used to with GTA. I mean, if you play other games and they have other things on there, show them some support, man, for being a legit source for the GTA community. I know they may have had uh, delayed times on accounts, things like that at certain points, but hey, at least they weren't uh at least they weren't scamming people you know what i mean so let me know what you guys think man make sure you guys hit that like button if you're new hit that sub button turn on post notifications and you guys have a good one peace